it your testimony today that you personally witnessed President Joe Biden commit a crime? I believe the fact that he was sitting with me while I was putting together a Did business Did you deal, witness the president commit it, it, a crime? Is it your testimony today? Yes. And what crime do you have you witnessed? How much time do I have to go through it? It is simple. You name the crime. Uh, Did you watch him steal something? Cor corruption statutes, RICO and conspiracy. What is it? What is, are, uh, what is the crime, sir? You, you specifically you, just, uh, you keep up. Uh, you asked me to answer the question. I answered the question. No, Rico, you're obviously not familiar with corruption. Excuse statute. me, sir. Excuse Mara. me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Rico is not a crime. It is a category. What uh, is no. the it's a category crime? of crimes that you're then charged? You have charges. A long hundred. You have charges. Statute. Sir, yeah. please you want me to name, name the exact statute on Rico. Yes. I'll, well, it's funny in this committee room, everyone's not here. There's over eight. All right, sir. I reclaim my lawyers time. that I went to law school. I oh, but it gets better. Listen to what Tony Bobolinsky said after. You're presented here today with two narratives in this investigation: a false one being pushed by Joe Biden, a serial liar and fabulous, now under this impeachment investigation for public corruption, his brother Jim Biden, a 75-year-old man who can't keep his lies straight, including under oath, and his son Hunter Biden, a chronic drug addict facing two indictments with 12 counts. So ladies and gentlemen, what did we learn from the hearing, from the impeachment hearing today? We learned several things, but the most important thing that we heard is under oath, Tony Bobolinsky, former best friend forever of Hunter Biden and business partner with the Biden family, said under oath, yes, I personally witnessed. I was in the room when Joe Biden committed crimes, crimes of RICO, conspiracy, fraud, money laundering. What else did we learn? The Democrats had a total meltdown. They can't stand the truth. They can't handle the truth. They were flailing their arms around, especially AOC. They will do anything to cover up the crimes, the lies, the forgery, the money laundering, the being paid off by foreign adversaries that is coming from the Biden crime family.